Some things that I imagine or what my life will be like when I grow up. What kind of person will I be? He's so unique. Oh my goodness, TJ. He loves art, he loves sports, he loves just life, you know? And he's a very good big brother. And I want him to feel proud of himself for how far he's come. Last year, our dryer went out. We didn't really have the extra money to get a new dryer. Are you guys buckled? And sometimes, if the clothes were too damp, we would have to send them to school in something that didn't get washed yet. It was very stressful. When the teacher isn't around, they say, there's something nasty on your shirt, and then start laughing. I know that I have students that think, would I rather stay home today than to walk into a classroom and wonder if people are whispering about me. Anything as a school that we can do to eliminate those barriers, we're of course going to do that. The Care Counts program installs washers and dryers in schools to improve attendance by giving kids access to clean clothes. If your washer or dryer breaks down or you don't have one, you can come up here, volunteer, and do your laundry. It's just such a great resource and it alleviates so many issues that might otherwise prevent a kid from coming to school. And they're more confident and they're not worried about how dirty they are or anything like that and they can just focus on being a kid. <laughs> Now that our community knows that we have this, everyone is starting to be involved with our school. You can volunteer while you're waiting on your laundry. You're out and you're communicating with other parents and with the teachers, the students. Seeing that change is just amazing. It's just another way to improve that connection with families and with a greater community. We're all a team, the school and his family. We're going to work together to give him everything that he needs. I feel powerful when somebody cheers for me, like somebody tells me that I can do things, and when I believe in myself. <laughs>